I'm going to talk a little bit about pointers, in case you're not 100% familiar with them. Imagine that the memory we have at our disposal has a series of lockers. Each locker has a number that identifies it. And whenever we create a new variable, something is stored inside a locker. Some lockers are bigger than others, because some variables are larger than others. When you create a pointer variable, instead of storing the actual value we have inside the locker, for example, 6 in this case, we are storing the number of the locker that the value is stored in. So whenever we pass a pointer around to a function, like we're going to do in this case, we are passing some information that the function can use to go to the specific locker we are storing in our window class and read it or even change it. Another important point, even though the variable can be huge, its address, which means that its identify number, will always be of the same size, which is 32 bits when you're compiling for a 32-bit platform and 64 bits when you're compiling for the 64-bit platform. So when we created the window class, we got a locker and we filled that with some information we needed. Now whenever we're going to pass a pointer to the register class, we're going to pass the number of the locker or the address of the variable. That's it. So let's do this. 